Hello guys and welcome to a brand new video. Today I'm here with Kiki's Delivery Service. Uh, this movie I have really no like idea about. Like this is the first time I've, I'm even hearing this movie's name, and um, I have like no clue as to what to expect from this. So this is like a really like blind reaction. That is like in a complete sense because I don't even didn't even know the movie. Uh, like name before like I checked out the Ghibli movie list and uh, like I found this uh, this has a quite high rating so I'm guessing this is as good as the previous movies I have like reacted to uh, the previous week I like reacted to Laputa and I really loved it like uh, I like in my opinion uh, like in at least in my list uh, Laputa is like at the top and then comes like Princess Mononoke and then like Spirited Away uh, I don't know why, but I really loved Laputa, and it had this uh, like an amazing kind of uh, like feeling while uh, like looking, while, like watch, watching the movie. Like I really loved it, and uh, like today I'm like doing like Kiki Still Very Service. So let's see um, what this movie is about. Uh, I only saw the poster. It has a little girl in it, so I'm guessing the girl's name is Kiki, and. <laughs> yeah, that's it and she does some kind of delivery. I don't know. So let's see. Let's check this out what this is about So without further ado, let's get started with Kiki's delivery service movie reaction Okay, I'll be putting the subtitles and the timer here Sync it to whichever is your preference and let's get started All right, so here's the countdown three two one go oh. Kiki's delivery service. Oriko. <clears throat> Wild winds will be blowing. Full moon, okay. Oh, I would be freaking out looking at that like bee. <laughs> I would run. <laughs> like I really don't like bees or like that kind of stuff. I'm scared. Like if they like bite me or something, I don't even know what will happen. So <laughs> yeah. <laughs> oh my god. Sometimes I wonder like how would it really be to like live in a village with like these kind of like forest and like Oh Okay they're doing, doing alchemy or something? What? Leave on the perfect night. Oh! Okay! Damn! Majo? She's a witch? Oh! Okay, so this is like a rite of passage. <laughs> mm. Okay, so they're like a doctor kind of like Oh, the cat talks. <laughs> what? <laughs> okay. Well, obviously, a witch needs a, needs a black cat.
Oh, English. The radio is speaking English. Oh. Well, well that's a shame. Oh. <laughs> oh my god. Oh. Okay. <laughs> All right. Oh my god, okay. <laughs> okay. <laughs> All right. Okay, so they don't even know where which town they're going to live. Uh, she's going to go. Oh, everyone's here. Oh, so this is like a big deal. Like, Disco. Uh, okay. Oh. Uh. Cat's name is Gigi? Like Gigi means old man, so... Alright. Okay, so... So it's, it's, oh, wait, that's a, what the, I, I, I was really, <laughs> I was startled at a slap in the room. what the hell was that, oh my god, what, <laughs> okay, <laughs> Okay, so Okay, she is struggling to control that broom, I can see. Or oh no, no, it's probably the like wind. So cake is delivery service. Is she going to deliver stuff on that broom? <laughs> like Wow. 
What's the song? To meet my boyfriend's mom? Okay. Okay, so this is like a uh, like everyday occurrence there, like a witch flying in the sky. I, at least I think so. Like, and there's like uh like scientific stuff as well, like airplanes and everything. So it's some magic and like science, like like usually in um like animes, like there are exceptions obviously, like. Like magic and science are like exclusive. Like if there's magic, everything is like magic. And if there's science, it's only science. There are difference like uh, magical index and uh, um, irregular at high magic high school Mahoka Koko. Those are like a few exceptions where magic and science are at the same place. Oh, this girl looks like one of those Ojo Samas. Okay, she's those one of those Ojo Samas. Okay. Um I can I can fly I can fly. Oh, so how do they like, like recognize the city that they're going to? Can they like pick one city on their like, based on their preference? <laughs> okay. Oh, oh my God, that's freaking scary. Okay. Yeah, I think you should probably take shelter for this night. Okay, there there she goes. Wow, that was smooth. Hmm. What? What's moving? What is that? Hey? Yeah, I think so. Okay, uh, thankfully the train doesn't start. Oh my god. Like, thankfully the train doesn't start to move and like take them somewhere else. Hmm. Oh no, it is really... Moving. Oh, great. Oh, oh boy. What was the like train doing in the middle of the tracks like that? Uh, this is like a. Uh, and oh oh <laughs> okay um <laughs> cows are like what the hell like we're having a <laughs> our breakfast and like Oh boy. Okay, she's not concerned at all. So I guess it's okay. Yeah, why like why ride a broom when you can like hop hop on a train? <laughs> okay. 
Yeah, that's a big city. Hmm. Okay. Okay, yeah, I saw this coming. But thankfully she controlled it. <laughs> Oh my god, the cat. Can you just like pick one city and say that, yeah, this is my city, I'm going to live here? Is that how it works? Like, what if like another witch lives there? Okay. Yeah, that was what I was thinking. Like, like, how do you even know that another witch is living here or not? Oh, I think you can probably ask the like residents there. Yeah, that's one way. Okay, this is a backed up city. A lot of people. Oh boy. This is reminding me of my place. Like, like in India, the population and everything. Okay. Lately. That means there were people like witches here before. Okay, so there is no witch here because they are like all looking so amazed. Yeah, that means there are no witches. Okay, you should probably look fr in front, not don't bump into some. Oh, Jesus! Okay. Uh Okay, well <laughs> Kiki and Gigi Um Why is no one saying anything? Uh, um, what's happening? That old man seemed pretty friendly, but these people are a bit, um, oh, yeah, yeah. Um, uh. Uh, yeah, scoot away. <laughs> oh boy. Uh, She's pretty mad. Okay. <laughs> oh boy.
Mm. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god, what? Oh my... <laughs> <laughs> um yeah yep you won't catch it like that <laughs> hotel minako yeah won't you need money to live Um, yeah, I can see one thing. Let's like the her mom was discussing with that grandma that uh, times have changed, and that we can see here. Like nowadays, like uh, at least at her time, I think like people didn't need this kind of identification or stuff like that. But now it's like this, like modernization and everything. You need some kind of ID everywhere you go, and yeah, like stuff like this. You can't like ride a broom in the middle of the street. Yeah, I can kind of get what they were saying at that time. Hmm. Uh, I think like all the towns are like this, like, kind of similar. Okay. So she's going to like deliver that, and that's why delivery service. Yeah, I think she's going to like hit up an idea now. Like, think they think like, yeah, like let me deliver this and <laughs> she at first she did not understand like. Like she didn't <laughs> like just holding a broom doesn't make you a witch. So after seeing it, then she understood. Like yeah, this is a witch. Oh, good timing. Shove it up the face. Yep. <laughs> okay. <laughs> All right, so um, the lady looked at her pretty. Mm. <laughs> oh yeah you also need some kind of a <clears throat> whoa what's with Hmm. 
<laughs> milk okay mm, yeah that is kind of true <laughs> oh Also no, okay. Hmm. All right. Ah. Well, nope, need to clean up first. <laughs> oh, boy. Yeah. No, I don't think you should like. <laughs> oh, oh no. <laughs> okay. <laughs> I thought maybe she, he was going to like uh, start liking that cat or something. <laughs> That's usually how it goes. <laughs> Hmm. Yeah, like as I said, like it's a big city, so the first uh, old man was uh, really like good to them. So just like that, like you'll meet a lot of people and a lot of like. What? Time to get up. <clears throat> hmm. Oh, this guy. Oh, okay, she has money. Okay, but how will you get a place to like open your business or whatever? You need a place and that would also cost money, rent and everything. And you also need like some kind of like an earning opportunity, some kind of part-time job or something so that 
keep the money coming in um ooh <laughs> that's fancy yeah i, I was thinking like yeah Okay, this lady, lady is extremely like helping her. Oh, she is pregnant. All right. <laughs> um. Wait, <laughs> what's with this guy? <laughs> okay. Yeah, so she got kind of a part-time job. She'll get that, like earn that money. Keep the money rolling in. And like use that money and the money she has. For like preparing the delivery service or whatever. And the good thing about delivery services, you don't need to invest much. Okay, calm down, girl. You don't need to invest much. You have to just like deliver stuff. Oh boy. <laughs> um. Okay, well, thankfully nothing happened. <laughs> hmm. <laughs> okay. Yeah. She's looking at the dress and oh no, the shoes. It's on a discount. Oh boy, here are the guys. Uh What's with the car? <laughs> What's with that car? Like, oh, uh. <laughs> yep. Well, that was fast. Okay, calm down. Oh, oh, this is that lady. Um, uh, like the neighbor, wasn't it, with the like white cat? Oh, excuse me. Is that a doll or a, a real cat? It must be a real cat, or, or otherwise, why would it be in a cage? Uh, let's see how much. Yeah, that's a lot of money.
Oh boy. <laughs> and here he goes. Well, she, like, he is pretty fascinated by a witch. And he also knows where she lives now. <laughs> okay. Mm, yeah, it's kind of correct. <laughs> Like, if you can fly like this, a map is really handy. That means you can like see the whole like landscape. Yeah. These are geese. <laughs> um, hello. Why are this? Yeah, what's happening? Oh, she can he can understand? Oh! Oh my god, what the What type of wind is that? Oh no, the Oh no. Yeah. yeah. Okay. E uh, um okay everything's fine i guess oh no oh okay um yeah run or fly <laughs> whatever uh, let the cat talk to him talk to him Is everything okay inside the cage? Like... What? Oh no, as... Oh great. I was thinking like if everything is okay inside the cage. Oh boy, and they are like... Uh... Oh boy. Okay. Uh, you know what I think? The amount of money she gave her is probably not <laughs> even worth this. Like, you need more money for this. Like, <laughs> if something like this happens. Oh my god. Yeah, now you have to like get inside. <sighs> oh. Yeah, I think uh, I think like crows are like <laughs> That's a good idea. <laughs> like Use him as a decoy. Oh, 
Oh, so that is a doll. That was a doll. That means, or something. I thought. I, I thought maybe that was a uh, like living cat or something. <laughs> oh boy, this. Oh my God, this little boy will probably traumatize the cat. Oh, so that was for the can canary. Uh, the cage was for that, and the cat was, I think, probably a toy or something. All right. <laughs> oh, he he's doing it good, like good in person, uh, like impersonating. Oh boy, a dog. <laughs> she can smell. <laughs> uh. Oh no. <laughs> yeah, as I was saying, like I think crows do not like uh like are not active during the night. So that is like so it will probably be better to like go and grab that during the night. yeah like where will you even like find that like that was like a small little thing cottage in the middle of the forest oh there it is someone took it with them oh a painter lives here Um, okay, she's a painter. Yeah, she's fast. Yeah, it fell down from such a... Oh, yeah, the crow. Mm, you can sew it up, I think. Yeah, her room was in a pretty like bad state, so she said like do some cleaning and I'll do your job. <laughs> okay. Hmm. The dog probably knows that it's a real cat. Like he can smell him. <laughs> oh no. Um you're sweating. I think that's a good dog. He'll, pr he'll probably lick you a little bit. Yeah, that's it. 
Like it's a domesticated dog. It's a like, and there you go. Yeah. Okay. Uh, you need to sneak in now. <laughs> okay. Oh. <laughs> Poor Gigi. What's he doing? Oh, is he going to like return it to Kiki? Like return Gigi to Kiki? Oh, that's a smart dog. <laughs> Marvelous dog. Um, yeah, you, you go and, oh, okay, and there you go, mm, that's a good dog. Well, everything went okay, so <laughs> oh. <laughs> Yeah, it's been pretty late, like. Well, the first time he, she did her job, so you're bound to make some mistakes. Oh. Well, no customers. Okay, well, yeah, like tending a shop is like that most of the time, it's like like sitting down. Oh, okay. <laughs> um. <laughs> oh, she's back. More deliveries or not?
Oh boy. Oh, the delivery service. He's having flashbacks to cat. <laughs> oh my god. And this guy is here. Uh Okay. Miss Witch, okay. Oh yeah, she has a job, so wait, another customer? Oh yeah. Can you do that? I don't think you can like Use a broom to deliver that like How much is it? Okay, she has a lot of things to do now. Okay. But you have a job to do. Oh. <laughs> yeah, run or fly, whatever. Okay, yeah, she's having trouble. Like, that's extremely heavy. <laughs> oh, boy. <sighs> no, one, yeah, another one is left. Hmm. Hmm. Okay. Yeah, it's a huge house. And fancy as well. Hmm. Wait, was okay. She knew Hmm. 
herring and pumpkin pie. Uh, what are you doing? Mm. Oh, yeah, this. Hmm. Mm, yeah. No. <laughs> Okay, and I'll blow the wind inside. Oh, <laughs> hmm. Mm, it's already five. Okay. Mm. Oh! Hmm... Let... Yeah, it's... Yeah, I think so. But she has to deliver it as well, so... That will also take a little bit of time. Mm. Oh my god, yeah, the weather. <laughs> Hmm. Hmm. Oh boy. Yeah. Oh, it's a uh. Nope, it's a clock.
Is this the same place that she was supposed to go? Like they were also having a party, so... Oh my god, it's... Oh boy, and okay, uh, it's not the same place. Okay, well, hmm. I don't think she'll go now like she's wet and everything so hmm Well, that girl, like the way she behaved. happening is she sick like she like she was wet the previous night so yeah I think she's sick yeah Uh, no. <laughs> mm. Yeah, you you have a, you're a cat, so <laughs> yep. Okay, so Oh, it's fine now. Oh. Uh. Hmm. <laughs> 
Oh, that cat. <laughs> okay. <laughs> um um Gigi Kiki was calling you so Oh one day has already passed okay Koppori Hmm. Okay. So I guess like Kiki, like Kiki's voice, you only like she can hear because like she's contracted to him or something because of something like that. I'm guessing like she couldn't hear like Lily's voice, but Kiki, like Gigi could understand Lily. So that means yeah, m must be that like because she's contracted or something like somehow connected to Gigi. That's why she can only like only she can hear Gigi's voice. I'm guessing. <laughs> oh, that's why she winked. <laughs> <laughs> I was thinking, like, why did she suddenly wink like that? Oh, wait, what is this? Oh. oh. Okay. What? What's that? Uh, will it really work? Okay, like that. Um, <laughs> okay, okay, does this have any breaks? I'm I hope so. Yeah. Okay, there it is. 
Okay. Okay. Um, this is pretty dangerous. Um. Uh. Oh, she was talking about that. Oh. Wait, it's it's really flying. What? Oh. My god, this is oh. <laughs> oh. <laughs> All right. Um yeah. Um okay. Uh, <laughs> mm, uh. Yeah, that was pretty like the not falling off the cliff, the cars coming. Like in front of you, like that was even more Oh, it was her. Okay, yeah, like suddenly it's like flying like that is not possible. So, <laughs> all right. Hmm. Okay, one thing. Like wh Yeah, like I was thinking like what would happen if a boy like gets born in a witch's family? Will he also be a like <laughs> Excuse me. Okay. And mm. Mm. Okay, these people are mm, Yeah well, This guy is okay, but like those people are a bit I think And <laughs> oh boy. And she has to like walk now. She doesn't even have the, her broom. <clears throat>
Oh well. And GG tier. This is GG, GG, isn't it? Mm. <clears throat> oh well ah uh. Wait a minute, why isn't he talking? Oh no, does this mean that after like interacting with her, he lost his power or something? Oh boy. Like... Wait, did she lose her magic or something? Oh, she can float, but... Okay, but why suddenly, like... She needs to contact her, like, mom, because I think the only one who can, like, probably answer something like this probably be his, her mom. Okay. Oh no, you broke. What? Uh. Oh, they're getting a tour or something? I think you should probably like go ask your mom or something. <laughs> 
Will I write some letter or something like that? A phone call? Okay, she's here. Mm. Oh boy. Mm. Well, one thing I'm thinking like is like losing her magic the reason why she cannot like like understand what Gigi is saying or really Gigi did like turn into a like normal cat. That's one thing in my mind. Because the way Gigi is acting, it seems as if she has like turned into a normal cat. Like, as like cats do, come in your house, like have some milk, eat some food, then like go on their own way. Oh. But one thing, like uh, when Kiki was riding the bicycle, her magic activated on its own. Like, is that some how the reason her, for her like suddenly losing the magic, and like she would probably get it back eventually. <laughs> I think that is somehow connected with this or something. Oh boy. Still mad. <laughs> All right. Oh, damn, that's quite imaginative, I must say. Like, what is that? A unicorn? Okay. Oh, these are the crows. And that is a unicorn with a 
what is that yeah like art is like that like abstract art especially hmm oh so that's why she like asked kiki to model model for her <laughs> okay well change of pace you need some change of pace like that's called slump so or an artist block they call it i think yeah that's also another way i guess yeah that was what i was saying change of pace This is just like another like skill that you have. Uh, like people get into slump and like now and then. So let's take a break and suddenly you'll see that yeah, I can like do it again. Oh. Spirit. All right. Oh. Okay.
पैकेज <laughs> yeah, we understood that when she was like trying to ride the broom. <laughs> oh, a cake. Oh, oh boy, the wind, okay, oh no, okay, um, uh, <laughs> okay, I don't think you should be excited at this. <laughs> Oh yeah, there it is. <laughs> oh. Uh. Oh no. Oh no. <laughs> Yeah, yeah, like jump. Oh no. Oh boy. Uh. Mm. Oh. Uh, you need the broom, uh, so... Okay, this is pretty damn... Um, I... Oh, 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 okay. Oh. Okay. Yeah, yeah, move. Uh, can you use that room? Um, uh, that's, that does not even look like a witch's room. Okay, so you can use any room, like, it doesn't matter. You like the power is lies within you, so oh,
Oh, okay, okay. <laughs> That's not how how a witch slides. <laughs> but okay, it, it's like it works. Whatever works is oh. 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 <laughs> yeah, that's how you should <laughs> like uh <coughs> like threaten your broom if it doesn't want to fly. Um uh, oh oh yeah oh my oh well thankfully the helium will not blast they already said it so oh no Oh! Um... Um, you should probably run like yeah like run what are you doing standing here oh my god <laughs> uh oh yeah the broom is the one i think who is oh boy Uh, oh. <laughs> okay, well. These guys are bringing a tramp trampoline now. Like, what the hell were you doing? At oh my god. Oh boy, okay. Yeah, tell him, tell him. <laughs> okay. All right. Um Okay, so now can he like did Gigi come to his senses or not? Okay. Okay, this looks a lot like an airplane now. Yeah.
Oh, she didn't spawn. <laughs> okay, so what actually happened to Gigi? Like, sh he cannot talk now? Like, did he also lose his powers after like interacting with that uh, cat? I'm guessing it's something like that. Or maybe not, who knows. Let's see if we have an like epilogue or something. Because like I thought at least like either GG like because of like uh, Kiki lost because of like Kiki losing her uh, magic kind of. She was unable to understand Gigi, but Gigi also like kind of changed because Okay, he is riding the broom. So... <laughs> like, holding a broom? <laughs> Okay. Oh, the letter arrived now okay all right okay we can see Gigi still riding the broom so I think this is more like uh like left to our interpretation or some uh, something I don't know like the end yeah like uh like one thing I am a bit uh I still don't like they did not show us is whether Gigi really like whether Kiki can now like again uh, hear Gigi's vo like voice Gigi talk like that was not shown in the end in the end we saw Gigi coming back and that was it but he's like riding in the broom with her, so I don't know. Like that's one thing. So if like Gigi really did not, uh, like uh, like Kiki still cannot hear Gigi. That means uh, the problem was with uh, like Kiki being unable to hear Gigi's voice. Uh, the problem lied not with Kiki but with Gigi. That means I think uh, he maybe he lost her his power. But uh, like even though he lost his power. Uh, like he was Kiki's cat and uh, I think uh, maybe contracted to her or something so even though he is unable to talk to her or like Kiki is unable to understand him uh, he is still like with Kiki and like accompanies Kiki in her jobs and everything like who knows uh, one explanation can be given here that is like uh, why uh, Gigi lost her uh, lost his like like his voice his ability to talk with Kiki uh, maybe because he came into contact with uh, the human world but uh, I don't know like if that is the case then the same can be applied to Kiki like Kiki also came into contact with humans like that boy and uh, so many other people so she should have also lost her power then so why only Gigi like that's also another question so I'm really not sure if that is what happened and if that is what happened so why did it also not Kiki like affect Kiki like that so that is like another question arises then like that so I'm still not sure what happened there but at least like they like like at least uh, he still like accomp accompanies Gigi, uh, Kiki in her deliveries like like even though they cannot understand each other I guess um but still yeah so but um like when uh no no that's something else like i was thinking like when uh, gigi uh, introduced uh, lily to kiki 
uh, at that time also like he could hear his voice so what happened after that that like suddenly they were like she was unable to like understand Gigi or Gigi lost her his powers like what actually happened who knows anyways um, that and um okay yeah that was this uh, movie um Kiki's delivery service that was a really like a nice movie um i enjoyed it quite a bit and <clears throat> this is another um what can i say like kind of like shows us a perspective of uh like modernization uh similar not as like heavy as uh, princess monoke like princess monoke had a really heavy type of uh, emphasis on this modernization and everything like uh, pollution and like people like switching to uh, more modern stuff but this is has like a more in a like large light-hearted sense uh, of like modernization where like we got to see uh, Kiki like her mother even said that uh, times are changing so like it's not like we used to do like uh, I'm guessing in her time she like didn't even need to like uh, have this kind of like ID passports like as the like policeman was saying and like she could have like uh, like uh, could ride on her broom wherever he she wanted to uh, now there are like these streets and these rules and everything like you have to uh, keep an eye on out like uh, whether if I'm like blocking the traffic or not stuff like that and many other things so yeah like uh that is like a like thing which shows us that mo like it's modernizing our like society is modernizing and everything and uh like we have now so many rules and regulations because of that to keep us safe so like you have also have to like change with the times and yeah and yeah that was a really uh, like nice movie uh the lady what was her name Os Os osana or osana uh, uh, anyways uh, the lady uh, like the landlady of the place uh, like thankfully kiki like met her because she like really helped her like a lot in in uh, many ways um so and like uh, her husband was also good so that was a nice family she met and thankfully she met them otherwise i'm guessing she would have like left the place the next day uh, because she really did not like the first like had a good impression of that place at the beginning like obviously like uh, like she was kind of uh, like she, she, like she was extremely new to this so coming into a place getting like a culture shock and she did not like the place at all so like thankfully uh, she met these this family who were nice to her kind to her and that's the reason why she like still like like she kind of settled there and uh started to like understand things and like hope and like uh like understand how the city works and everything and started to like adapt to it so yeah and yeah and later on uh when kiki lost her magic like uh it's the same as like uh people get like uh, you know this kind of slump people get into i think they call it an artist's block i'm guessing where like suddenly you are unable to do what you did the best like if you're a painter you like suddenly one day after st you start painting you feel as if like no it's not working and you started feeling like what the hell is happening why am i unable to draw and the frustration like this usually happens to people who are extremely passionate about the subject like for example a painter who is extremely passionate about painting uh can like get this thing suddenly and that also like uh, feeds the frustration as to like yeah i'm like trying my best and i love this thing so much so why is it still not working i'm doing so much like practice and everything so why is my like hard work not paying off and this also like kind of kind of makes you depressed and everything like that's like a slump and like as they say like at uh, that time you have to like stop whatever you're doing and like like I, I've seen like an, in animes and everything a lot of people do this is like go to new new place go on a vacation like just take change of like make a, like take a change of pace and suddenly the, your inspiration and everything will come back to you just like that normally 
so like it's the same like that like magic is also like that as i said that it's also a kind of a skill that you have so like everything that she wants is like to do her magic better she's a witch in training so that's the reason why like after suddenly losing it she became like rattled and everything she thought like yeah that's the only thing that i have left for me like that's the only thing that i can do so if i am even unable to do that so what am i left with so that also kind of like made her more depressed and everything so made her cranky and like later on after like uh, having a good talk with uh, the other girl the painter girl um like uh yeah she understood like yeah i also need to just stop and uh, excuse me just stop whatever i'm doing take a break so i'll be fine and yeah she later on got her magic back obviously because of the dangerous situation that uh, tombo was in and yeah all well uh, all's well that ends well but uh, one thing that uh, like is still a kind of a mystery is why did she suddenly lose her magic i think like is it somehow related to that like sudden outburst of magic that happened when tombo was like bicycling and she was behind him and when they were like almost going to crash then like, like her magic suddenly activated in quite a huge amount like uh like the whole bicycle was floating and everything so was that the reason why i don't know mm, who knows uh yeah and one thing this anime like <laughs> like it kind of like scared me in little bits especially like those cars like how they were like moving like in the first uh instance where like uh kiki is new to the place and she gets in the place with a broom and she's like flying and she, <laughs> like, she, like she was like looking uh, like on the other side or something and she gets into the bridge and suddenly you see a like car coming <laughs> Like that scared me like it, like it, it was a literal jump scare suddenly like that i i i was thinking I, like i knew maybe so, like something was going to happen there but i thought maybe like she was going to bump her head in the like bridge or something or some kind of a lamp post or something else some sign some kind of thing uh, but i was not expecting like suddenly a, like a car coming in front of you like that like like <laughs> like that's an isekai moment <laughs> oh my god like just imagine like that that suddenly like was like out of the blue it came and like it really like startled me and <laughs> like that was not the only like time after that suddenly like when tomo was cycling and like kick was behind her uh, behind him that was also another scary portion like they fell down from the bridge that was not scary like that was at, like at, not scary at all the scary part was before that like when they were like riding the bicycle and like like suddenly like two or three cars are like in front of them just like oh boy uh like if you fall down from a height you can kind of survive but but if a car like in full speed like comes and like drives into into you like uh that that's something uh i don't know like that's a really scary thing <clears throat> or i guess like i've seen a lot of like <laughs> like he's <laughs> like trakun is extremely like uh, like does his job pretty well in anime so like looking at trakun for so many time like so many animes it, it kind of like is like a thing like whenever you see trakun uh, a fear runs inside you uh, a fear and also kind of an expectation like am i going to be isekai <laughs> oh my god okay <laughs> oh boy and all right yeah as i was saying yeah this was like an uh really uh what uh what can i say this was a um good like happy type of movie and it was nice like definitely nice uh and <clears throat> excuse me and uh this is like a society where there is like science and magic as well which is uh a bit unique uh especially at that time like this is a really old movie so i don't know if some other anime also like Im like at that time implemented this whole thing because uh usually in animes you see like either magic or either science 
and uh, like if there is like magic in the uh, world that you're living in then people usually do stuff with the, that magic like uh, it's like as they're saying like flying and doing stuff alchemy these kind of stuff uh, but if there is like science prevalent then science is the only thing there are like exceptions to that uh, which are like as I said before uh, magical index Twaru no Madhusuno index and um, Mahoka Koko no Reto say that is regular at magic school these are a few exceptions uh, where like science and magic are both in the same place and they like combine it and use it for like more like amazing stuff but those are a lot like came a lot later on this is extremely old so I'm thinking like is this uh, like the first time that it was implemented like this kind of uh, science was and magic like the science thing here the technological thing here is the airplane that we see like we can see uh, an airplane which is made of like machines and everything and man-made things and at the same time we can see a witch who is like using magic to fly so yeah like that is what i was saying like <clears throat> this is pretty old so I don't know like I would not be surprised if uh, like in anime this is the first like anime movie which has implemented this whole like science and magic together like I would not be surprised because it is quite old so who knows maybe not maybe there was some other anime which like implemented this whole thing before but it was pretty nice to see <clears throat> yeah and yeah that was uh, this movie and another thing I was uh, really uh, not expecting was uh, the broom like sh the, like the like thinking about it it is kind of correct like the power is within her not in the broom uh, the broom is just I think the medium that they use so like he like took this kind of like deck brush and uh, the old the man had and used it to fly so like the broom doesn't matter but uh, I'm guessing the broom also matters in a way because she was also like kind of uh, like like talking with the broom saying like you be a good uh, like uh, like a good broom and just like take me to uh, like help me and stuff like that like he was she was kind of like talking to the broom and the broom was also like it felt as if like the broom also had its own personality like it was really like uh, I don't know like <laughs> the kind of like uh, doing its own thing so yeah anyways so i'm guessing it's something along the line that uh he, she uses her magic to like awaken the broom or something i don't know and like uh like the broom gets kind of magically awakened and helps her to fly but like different brooms have different kind of a personality or something who knows uh, maybe the broom that her uh, like mother used like that she was using up until now uh, that broom obviously her mother used the broom a lot so the the broom is kind of experienced i think so she did not have any kind of trouble flying with it but like using this like new broom that he she suddenly got from a man who was like sweeping the floor and the broom was kind of uh like uh defiant and was not like like listening to her at all so yeah, that's just something that i thought maybe it is somehow like that okay so yeah, uh, that's it. Uh, that was this movie. Uh, that was an enjoyable movie, and uh, yeah, I liked it quite a bit. And uh, I think we should probably like give it like uh, the rating that M A L like my animalist gave it uh, eight point five. I think is correct. Like this is uh, this movie like deserves an eight point five. Uh, it's a pretty nice movie. Uh, it uh, like it was entertaining. Look, like watching it and everything. Uh, so yeah. So, so yeah guys and that's it thank you guys for watching so okay uh, let me just uh, like decide which movie I'll do next week just a sec okay guys uh, the next movie I'll do is uh, whisper of the heart Mimi wo sumaseba uh, I'll do it next week and uh, this also has a pretty high rating so I'm looking forward to it so anyways guys and that was uh, this movie and this was uh, uh, what was this? Uh, Kiki's delivery service. So if you guys enjoyed my reaction, press the like button and subscribe if you're new to the channel or you haven't subscribed, please consider doing so. And comment down below anything you want to say, your opinions about this movie, uh, anything else, I'll be sure to check them out. 
Mm, so yeah guys uh, so yeah thank you guys for watching i'll be back then uh, the next week with another movie uh, that is uh what was that a whisper of the heart uh, i forgot already yeah whisper of the heart so next week with whisper of the heart so thank you guys and i'll see you guys next week so until then goodbye and have a nice day